Well, the next act, 24-year-old Greg certainly hopes so. Yeah, good good. Next you feel alright? Um, a little okay. <laughs> a little okay? <laughs> <laughs> my name's Greg Pritchard, I'm 24, and my act is singing. Greg is a hotel waiter by day, but his true passion is singing. I earn a living by working at the, a local hotel as a waiter at the moment. Just money just to afford to pay for my car and just general living costs, really. I definitely don't want to do that for the rest of my life. Hey, hey, I want to be a rock star. I've always sung in the car and stuff like that when I was younger and in my bedroom. My mum is always shouting at me to turn the music down and stop singing. Greg's hoping that this competition can take him out of the 9 to 5 and onto the Royal Variety stage. The main reason why I've entered Britain's Got Talent is to get through to the Royal Variety performance. Ever since I was younger, I've always seen artists who are at the pinnacle of their career and I think that states to everyone in the world that you've made it as a, a performer. I would love to be the second Welsh person to win. They're ready if you're ready. Okay, ready. Good luck, man. Hey, hey, I wanna be a rock star. Hey, hey, I wanna be a rock star. Hello. Hi. Uh, what's your name, please? Greg Pritchard. Okay, why are you here? I'm here to make a dream come true. Which is? To be a worldwide performer. Okay. And what do you do when you're not singing, Greg? When I'm not singing, I work in a hotel as a waiter. Okay. Do you hate it? Pretty much, yeah. Well, good luck, Greg. Thanks very much. Happened, should it? Pardon? That shouldn't have happened. <laughs> what is the term for your voice? Um, what? It's kind of termed counter tenor, but I'm a male soprano. Okay. Yeah. Which is kind of from the Baroque period in operas and all that kind of thing. <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh. Yes? <laughs> I mean, it was one of the most extraordinary things I've ever heard that. I mean, I, of all the things I expected to come out of your mouth, that was the last thing on my list. <laughs> But I have to say, I thought you did it brilliantly. It was a great act. Yeah. Thank you. What do you think, Simon? Well, it's like a dog meowing. <laughs> you know, it, it just shouldn't do that. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> would I like a dog to meow? I guess I would, yeah. yeah. Why not? Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Uh, you, you've puzzled me, Greg, I'm telling you. <laughs> OK, here's yes or no. I am going to say yes. Thank you. Amanda? 
I'm going to say yes. <laughs> uh, Greg, I'm going to say I haven't got a bloody clue. <laughs> but you're through. <laughs> Thanks, say that. Well done, Greg. Oh, is that <laughs> one of the most <laughs> surreal things I have ever seen in my life? He's a little star, that guy. The audience loved him. It was fantastic. Fantastic. Brilliant. Two years ago, Paul yeah. Potts walked on the stage, sang Ness and Dorma, and shocked us all. Yeah. You've walked on stage today, sang Ness and Dorma, and shocked us all for very different, different reasons. reasons. <laughs> <laughs> but it's been brilliant. Thanks very much. Well nice done. to meet you, Ben. Well, well done, Ned.